Watch and be horrified as we change the regulator air settings. God almighty. I'm scared already. Do you want your audio stereo or mon aural? It was pretty much Sega's answer to Resident Evil, even though... What is it with you and Sega? It's Sega everything. I I mean, I like Sega in a way. Are you sure? Because you're putting up a poor case for it in recent months. <laughs> I mean, okay, that's fair, but... I mean, they, they had sort of a shotgun approach to video games. It's it's kind of hard to separate the wheat from the chaff Wait, we there. can make games that aren't quick time events? Apparently you can make them like a... Uh, what the hell is this, the Enterprise? I don't know, but I'm hypnotized right now. I feel like it's a Mayan calendar. Oh no, it's a... It's a Something uh, landing. Oh, it's a, it's a funnel arriving just in time for a spring break! Rainbird. Do you read? <laughs> Rainbird, really? Uh, Reverb, can't understand a word you're saying over. <laughs> submarine theme! Whoa, my god. It's a submarine! Deep fear. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they're, they're half, they're halfway right on the title so far. <laughs> it's, we're deep, I'll give it that. <laughs> 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 my deviant art girlfriend. I was looking at my anime girlfriend. I do not want to be disturbed. Mookie, your webcomic is shit. Mookie? Mookie, that's Mookie on the right. Gee? <laughs> what? What's going on? April Fool's. Deep fear. <laughs> Did you forget a tape? Oh my god. <laughs> the horror. The horror. Sad submariners against drunk driving. Move over, exorcist. Gee, I think they need you. That was his emergency call. I wonder what happened. Oh, come on. Better go. Hey, Chief, you got a cold? You could say that. John, take care of yourself. It's a yes or no question. <laughs> the all important John Mayer cold plot thread. Of Whenever someone asks if you have a cold, do you say, you could say that? <laughs> yeah. If you haven't noticed, Deep Fear ha is basically Resident Evil underwater. I'm getting that huh. impression from the tank controls and the not first aid spray. I'll note. I, I hope you note though the animation is somehow much worse than the original Resident Evil. But the voice acting comparable. <laughs> like, look at that. He did, he like goes from like a standing to just a full on sprint animation, but it's really slow. I feel like Chariots of Fire should play every time I see him run. It's like the Quap guy. It's about as fast as you've gotten him. <laughs> Ernest Evans is deep fear. <laughs> Mayor, we've got a serious situation. What's the problem? A while ago, the Sea Fox, which was just getting ready to depart, crashed into the Navy area. Crashed? And no one likes my what mustard happened? suit. We don't know yet. <laughs> I asked Dubois, the designer, to come too. Oh, there's no problem with my Sea Fox system. No accident should have occurred. What, what is he supposed to be parodying? Jalo, I think? We have no idea what's going on over there. This is terrible. My masterpiece is ruined. Pardon him, he inhaled some helium before you came in. Can you believe I'm this game's Wesker? <laughs> I don't know if he is, I was just throwing that out there. Shoot me with a rocket launcher, I fucking dare you. <laughs> the little shark is this game's tyrant. Bad guy ye then. I haven't. I, I actually have not seen this far into the video, so I really don't know how Deep Fear is going to resolve its seemingly complex plot. Oh, the plot runs deep. Fear. Whoa. I'm just. I just want to see more Mookie. Oh my God. I want this elevator CGI'd now. <laughs> yes, sir. Good. Good. You, thank, you wanted a, thank a you. green filter over or anything, right? Because that's underwater. You know, it looked a lot better in my head, but we'll keep it. Thanks. I'll go first. Can't wait to get a look at the top secret weapons. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the, the Navy has neither chain morph commands nor voice acting skills. Uh-oh. More. I want my walking into the elevator CGI just like my elevator riding CGI. Hello, Chief. I didn't think you were that old. Oh, <laughs> uh, this is our first zombie of Resident Evil scene. What's this? <laughs> it's like he's doing ab exercise. Oh, he's the Hulk. Oh, he's hulking out, yeah. Alright, cool. You wouldn't like me when I badly act. <laughs> Too bad the Navy didn't give us weapons. He's, oh, his cool. skin's melting? I guess he's just exploding on his own. Alright, guys, just see this out, okay? Just work with me here. <laughs> what do you think? This is bad! We haven't finished our mission. 
We have to save the doctor. Our mission to gesticulate as much as possible. I turn into a monster. I know. That was strange. <laughs> that was strange. Yes, this is Mayor. Clancy, what's the situation over there? Besides the air system being down, there seems to be no major damage. You wouldn't lead with the monster? <laughs> it's monsters? You inverted pyramid, dude. Oh my god, not the tyrant. Already? On level one? Well, the tyrant fell. John Mayer is instantly the best action hero of all, because he just doesn't give a shit. Ah, uh, whatever. Like, Whoa, what the fuck? What? Uh, that's the game's writers having a meeting. <laughs> Comic monkey character, you are the best. This is the most disturbing fucking CG just monkey Just wait till all the seen. escort quests involving the monkey. Your boyfriend? I'm a mute CG character, I'm sorry. <laughs> Pause for laughs, none, move on. I heard everything from Dr. Weisberg. How did you get here? Turning into a creature? What's going on in the Navy area? What goes on in there is top secret. Now, I'm afraid I can't answer your questions, but I will say this. The Navy has nothing to do with the creatures. But, but... Anyway... <laughs> You're gonna forget this, right? The Navy area will be sealed off. Anyway, I have this phone call, bye. We're not supposed to make sounds, right? Because, oh god, who could have seen it coming? The missile launch theme in action. What did he say? The lunch? Oh, I thought he said the lunch. It's been lunch! <laughs> the world's most awkward camera angle. Uh-oh. Let's see how this plays out, gentlemen. I bet Mookie is gonna make a bigger <laughs> sound. It'll be okay. That's the same look I would give with my dog shit the carpet. <laughs> I'm mildly concerned with that tor loose torpedo. Uh, I don't know what to log on to. Warning, none of this makes any sense. Oh, is that thing on the right the torpedo, or is it a little white thing? Uh-oh. There it is, I see it. Oh, I think it's a lock. God, Mookie, why? This is all Mookie's fault, seriously. <laughs> well, I hopefully it killed some monsters. Unit, but its safety system was on. And we don't have the budget to show it. But the air system isn't working. The pressure's dropping! <laughs> My mouth is not saying these things clearly. Launch air missiles! Mayor, you were a SEAL Team 6 member, right? Did Whoa. You were training and decoding nuclear missile launches? Nuclear? Uh, yeah, but... I'm sorry, we don't have any time. Get aboard the Sea Fox and take care of the situation. Go now! But, but... Your submarine is <laughs> not with the Sea Fox. Just in case, I'll give you this. The ultimate soldier. It's a standard weapon store. Here's three dollars. What happens in the Sea Fox? <laughs> Is that a monster or just someone stupid? Oh no, don't talk to that guy, you'll talk your heir to death. <gasps> you know, you're okay, there's still eight. Why, why are you doing that? He just downloaded the plot of Deep Fear and, well... <laughs> just one second. Yeah. <laughs> where, I'm, where we're going, we won't need eyes. <laughs> well, now he should be fine. I mean, that was all he needed to do. Do you understand touchscreens? By the way, let's... If only let's he had looked to his left, he would have been fine. If only you'd saved your game, I mean, doesn't buddy. he work on the sub? I don't think. Wouldn't he know to do... <laughs> I guess not. Hey, a rocket launcher, sweet. <laughs> oh god, a monster. How did... <laughs> <laughs> you had a fucking mask the whole time, apparently. <laughs> oh my Are god. Are you okay? <laughs> this game is ten hours long, you said? <laughs> yes, somehow. Okay. Like, We're allowing YouTube comments to give us the plot. <laughs> Let's hope so. Did you, did, did you just download bullets? Is there any challenge in this game whatsoever? Ah, infinite ammo, good. Back to work. <laughs> I can't advance any further. Oh, f f come the fuck <laughs> on. <laughs> A fire extinguisher capsule. <laughs> in this age, every, every chemical is made grenade form. <laughs> Whatever you do, don't throw the air grenade at the fire, please. Are you somehow alive? <laughs> oh. No. <laughs> what? Let me just use this autopsy grenade and figure out how he died. <laughs> <laughs> right before the ladder grenade. <laughs> just use the missile control key grenade and... Oh my god. Uh, oh my god. Oh, oh no. 
Oh my god, he dropped from the ceiling. Did you see that? Oh my god, how I never expected it. He literally came down from the ceiling. My god. I mean, if Sega isn't the milestone of gaming, I don't know what is. I think we have a real, real grenade now. We'll just throw it nowhere near the monster. <laughs> oh, how did that work? Oh my god, we have five Whoa. full minutes. 300 seconds with zero air? You know what? I think I think this is as good a time to end it as any. On a cliffhanger. I know. Will John Mayer escape the trap that... I mean, if the know. game's gonna throw a suspense grenade at me, I guess I'll take it. <laughs> you might have to, my friend. Wow. I'm gonna... I'm just spraying myself with a suspense kit right now. <laughs> so, what happened on a previous episode of Deep Fear? No one knows, honestly. This is... Well, I ironic as we brought you on board to help us out, are you as confused as well, or...? Well, uh, John Mayer is an ex-member of Navy who joined this <laughs> small rescue group called uh, the Electric Light Orchestra a week ago. Oh my god. I'm glad we got the guy who made the Deep Fear wiki here with us. <laughs> now, uh, ERO uh, is basically a team of people who make local and federal rescues because somebody needs to bail out uh, the auto industry. And the game takes place in their underwater section. I think the most important point from this plot summary is the reason that no one <laughs> seems to be acknowledging John Mayer's cry of monsters, monsters. Point nine. Go it ahead. is something that is referenced in part one, but can mm -hmm. easily slip you by. But apparently it's April Fool's Day. Really? That's, it that's, is, I'm not even joking. That's the reason the game, that, oh, John, come on. <laughs> the game takes place on April 1st. No one believes him about the monster. I know you've only been here a week, but you're such a cut up. Wipe the blood off your shirt and then tell us what's going on. I like on. to think the U.S. military has some kind of protocol for that. <laughs> like, the, the Russians are launching missiles. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> you're not getting me, Clyde. Are you guys ready? I'm um, good to go. Alright, Deep so. Fear 2. Oh my god, more Deep Fear. Enough Sea Fox, let's get to the Sea Fox. It got so scary, Ironicus had to leave. <laughs> Ridiculous. The intro was too scary for him. So just for the record, I have no idea what we're escaping exactly. Yeah, there's a countdown, but we thought John Mayer had stopped everything. I guess stopping the nuclear launch caused another countdown. Speaking of, John, there's a countdown. Nothing's more intense than running through blue jello. <laughs> this forced perspective, I couldn't tell how close he was. Neither John Mayer nor the monsters exhibit any sort of buoyancy. Oh, I thought he was going to clothesline the monster, but no. <laughs> Sorry, ex-Navy member. One last fuck you to the wall over there. <laughs> I hate this submarine. <laughs> this has been a pain in the ass. This is the worst April Fool's Day. I'm scared, slow beef. Do you know what happens here? I'll go first. I'll nope. take a look it's around. Scary. I, I haven't read ahead in the deep fear plotline. I have, and I gotta tell you, I'm sure that guy's okay. Despite the fact that we saw a guy turn into a monster earlier, I'm sure that's and not possible it. that that could happen to him as well. I don't know why the virus caused such as a such a painfully looking thing to happen, but uh, whoa, that, did we miss part of the transition? <laughs> it was just. Nails pop off, and then monster. That's it. <laughs> ah! Oh, that's it for Mookie. Oh. Aw. According to text in the box, he had a crush on the head researcher, too. Oh, Mookie got finger paint all over the windshield. <laughs> this would be so dramatic if I'd known Mookie for more than, like, an hour. Mookie. I like to... Alright, this is what annoys me, too. He's such a useless character that he couldn't have even with his last breath hit that button. That's apparently important. He just accidentally fell on it. This calls for another countdown sequence. The composer's like, You used my sad music on this? Look how angry he is. Wow. Over Mookie's death. You underestimate the appeal of Mookie, my friend. <laughs> my smirk went down a little to show I'm sad. <laughs> Alright, loading. I had 41 ammo, and I'm going to use at least 10 of that on your sorry ass. Sorry, 89 <laughs> ammo. <laughs> I'm breathing so heavy, this 50 air won't last very long. I mean, if there's chemicals. limited air, why doesn't he always put on the air thing that recharges? Well, apparently it doesn't actually recharge. Like, if you really watch the meter... Oh, it doesn't? It's No, I, I, don't, I don't know exactly what the 
Well, can't you download more air like you do bullets? Well, I guess we just downloaded like eight fucking first aid kits from that shelf. <laughs> That's what I like about this game. They're like, you want some items? We got plenty. Don't worry. Just Forget take it. them all. I'm sure whatever that was is very informative and helpful well, to understand this game. We have to make an insecticide is the idea. See, I can't idea. take any of these memos seriously when it's April Fool's Day. What if they're all kidding? <laughs> You have to make an insecticide with drug A. Nah, forget it. <laughs> drug A and drug B. <laughs> They'll buy that, I'm sure. Should we go to 1F? Only if we get a thank you. Ooh. Yes! I mean, without that, I would have no sense of continuity. I mean, 2F Absolutely. to 1F? What the hell? I know. <laughs> I'd like to say it's a good way to mask loading, but apparently not. <laughs> now that we've blown your fucking minds, just soak it in for a second. <laughs> Don't you have... A, shouldn't you have another air counter for... The reserve air? I and also he has more air than HP. I mean, so that's gonna start running well once he's out of air too. Did he you has... see that elevator? Wait, what else? Oh, I missed it! Oh my god! Wow, graphics! That was the most amazing CG ever. <laughs> Go fuck yourselves, Pixar. It's not the horror of Deep Fear that makes my heart skip a beat. It's the production value. So here's a puzzle. There's two substances that make the insecticide, but you need a code to make it out of the two chemicals. And the code is the same as the guy's birthday at the picture we just looked at. Anyway, here's eight air grenades. <laughs> and that's all I got from this. <laughs> Six, seven. I mean, don't you just mush eight. the air grenades together and you have insecticide? Nine? <laughs> wow. Wait, come on. <laughs> Hold on. Deep Fear is a really difficult game. Fourteen? <laughs> So John's just walking out of the room with an armful of air grenades. <laughs> that too after 14, like, you can't carry anymore, I'm sorry. We're just giving them away. Air grenades, air grenades, air grenades. <laughs> <laughs> the end, game's over. Roll credits. <laughs> Has John ever expressed worry over the air? One thing I will say, by the way, te not, a, not to me, text in the boxes, no, don't go over why the big table is now full of monsters. Have you noticed that? Like, shouldn't it have been yeah. confined to the submarine? And maybe top Smokey? Hmm. Like, what? where the hell did all these fuckers come Look from? Look at that elevator! <gasps> oh, I've oh, forgotten oh. everything I was saying. Help me out here. What is John doing right now? Okay, as I understand it, he just saved the world from nuclear disaster because the Sea Fox was going to launch nuclear missiles. Right. Right. But then he... And he's, they were going to go back on board the big table, but the Navy SEAL team is already there, which is why they had to use a different entrance to it, mm -hmm. a different moon pool. Wait, hang, hang on one second, Sloby, if there's uh, something Oh, going. sorry. Yeah, sorry. Look. Just... Mm -hmm. Okay, go on. I'm sorry. We're, we're Yeah, the yeah, Emerald yeah. Elevator has passed. Right. Um, the top secret Navy sub becomes infected with a, spray, a strange virus that forces anyone who can't kill themselves fast enough to turn to bloodthirsty aliens. This presumably killed the captain, Did causing the submarine that? to crash. No, I didn't. What? Just skipped the elevator sequence. Shut up. That didn't happen. Seri no, I'm, I'm, I'm serious. I'm not even fucking with you. I looked away to read that. Are you serious? Yes. Why? What the fuck? That's like the most interesting part of this whole fucking thing. Who played this game? <laughs> the real blue dragon. You are on my watch list, the I... real blue dragon. I don't think he understands what fear really is. You don't seem to understand the draw of this game, sir. I don't think he understands what depth really is, either, if you want to know. Just my frank opinion. I don't know how deep deep fear goes unless I see elevators moving places. I mean, that's how you know depth. Exactly. Duh. It puts my fear into perspective a bit, and I would appreciate it's it if you left those elevator sequences intact. Just like the designers left it intact when you slowly put on your fucking mask in every room. Yeah, way to shed all over their vision. <laughs> Seriously. Ah. You're you're letting down that one composer. It, it, well, <laughs> there we go. Oh, there. Back that's on track. It. That's Thank how you, you show off a game properly. Absolutely. I mean, did you see that elevator go? <laughs> what, is this a long play or a sloppy blowjob? <laughs> is this you a long play or is it art now? I can't tell. I'll just slowly put on my mask, which is fucking full of water now. And that lab coat's hanging really well despite being underwater. <laughs> Everything is. Everything seems pretty, uh, pretty, pretty yeah. Yeah. Is that a light underwater? Is that a candle underwater? Why the fuck not? Well, we need an elevator sequence to break this up. What's the MI area? Oh, hey, hang on. Hold on, hold on a second. 
Okay. Yes! Yeah! Oh my god, I feel like it's a metaphor for deep sex. Deep fear, baby! This cell transforms into other living things and copies their original characteristics. I've never seen anything like this. Never seen anything so stupid in my life. A human turning into a creature. The transforming cell eats the original cells at a high speed and eventually takes over the body. You know, Mookie had a thing for Is you. Is there anything that can stop it? it? It must have a weak point. April Fools, I'm just making shit Something up. Oh. What about the chimpanzee? Anthony, Who cares? I can't find him. I'm worried. <laughs> Good. Okay, bye. Gripping scene. Really though, they needed to like computer animate drawing blood like that? <laughs> Wow, now it's a realistic video game, oh, motherfucker. No one's ever seen that before. Anyone who hasn't ever been to a doctor ever. I can't believe we lost Mookie so early in the game. I know, right? What a jerk. I thought he'd be one of those enduring characters. <laughs> enduring or endearing? What did you say exactly? A little bit of both. I got some good news for you, okay. by the way. Alright. This is the last um, part? <laughs> no, no. There's, there's things that happen in this video. Oh, there's content. There is. It's ridiculous. The parasite cell is weak in oxygen. Oxygen? For most What's animals, that? oxygen is actually lethal. Because of the low level, <laughs> humans can live on Earth. Why are we panning the around her? The parasite cell has a lower oxygen tolerance than humans, so even the oxygen in the air weakens them. That means... <laughs> if we fill the big table with a lot of air, then the parasite cell should weaken. Let's go release the netlock. Netlock? <laughs> the worst alien threat in the world. Oxygen? <laughs> you, thought, you thought signs was bad when they were bad with water? <laughs> These people can't even handle it. These aliens can't even handle air. I'll notify you when I found the creature's weak points. Well, how'd you get past the monster and the... Okay. Oh, never mind. Be careful. John. I love you. Thanks for everything. <laughs> You're welcome, Dr. Weisberg. <laughs> Call me Gina. Oh, hey. Whoa, okay. Gina. How about I help you catch my cold? <laughs> Do you want some deep fear from my crotch? You could say that. <laughs> Wait, I'm sorry. That wasn't a very good pickup line. <laughs> Never mind. I should stick Go back, back to my eyes. hotter lines like oxygen? Oh, it's completely stupid looking. <laughs> my arch nemesis, chicken snake. Really? That's what you do? You just hide? You can't Mortal Kombat walk your way out of this, John. It'd be polite if you told me your name Whoa. first. Mm. What is wrong with your torso? Um, about those steroids you're right. using. I'm John Mayer, ERS. Rescue Squad? How do I know you're not a creature? <laughs> um, I don't look like you? <laughs> I could ask you the same question. <laughs> and more legitly. I'm coming down. She's the most beautiful woman I've ever seen. <laughs> also, I'm blind. Well, your legs are broken. <laughs> Do I look like a monster? <laughs> In a way, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Do I look like a monster to you? Yeah, kind of. <laughs> yeah, sort of. You look like a hideous beast from the great no unknown. <laughs> Granted, I will never grow any facial hair, but still, lady. <laughs> I mean... You look like you just came back from a shave. <laughs> Unfortunately, not a very close one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> anyway, uh, off to the garage of these apartments. If only that lady were still here, she could open that door for me. <laughs> sea Slow Beef Central Park. <laughs> you know, if I were building an undersea base, I would make sure to include a lot of plant life. Well, that's where you get your oxygen? Wait, something's wrong there. <laughs> All right. Let's go to 2F, why not? If that lady had run out of ammo, she would have uprooted those trees herself and beat off the monsters gonna, with those. You, are you actually talking over the elevator? I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Oh, it's the... It's Rambo. Is that dog wearing pants? Oh, it's just... The dog's using steroids. <laughs> Him and its owner. Well, did you see his owner? Yeah, I know. Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's how the dogs eat, John. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna have the Rambo. shits for days. He's not supposed to eat that. 
You look tougher than me, I just want to say that. Rambo weighs 500 pounds, by the way. Don't feed my Thank dog you. burgers. Well, this looks safe to shower in. <laughs> you know, you tell off, a grenade tends to fall out of your naked ass. It'll happen. <laughs> oh, that grenade was... That's what was between my ass cheeks. <laughs> well. Alright, no wonder I was uncomfortable. No wonder I was farting so much, I had air grenades up my butt. <laughs> That's what you call it when you fart, actually. <laughs> Sorry, let loose a couple of air grenades back there. <laughs> Can I tell a funny true story while we've got some downtime? Oh, this is downtime? <laughs> I think so. Okay. <laughs> Shockingly. Go ahead, um, if you can I tear my attention away from this action. <laughs> I have a coworker who's a man he manages a couple people, and he actually had to yell at one of his employees for farting too much at work. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> I swear to god this is true. And like during oh wait, well, so, so, shit. I swear to God, this is true. Um, during his review, at the end, he's like, you're doing great work, but listen, I gotta talk to you man to man. You are blasting farts at work, and people are complaining to me. <laughs> and the guy's like, really? I didn't know it. He's like, yeah, you really are. You gotta stop that. Was it that they were so, loud, or that they smelled, or both? He would, both. He would apparently lift his leg up and just let it go. <laughs> <laughs> like, and this guy who, like, sat in the cube next to him was like, had to always leave. And complain, like, I can't do my work. He's Productivity like, is down 30%. <laughs> we can quantify the effect of your farts. Due to air grenades. Due to these air grenades. <laughs> so, now a little Gina. something for the ladies. Wow, the game's even easier now. <laughs> Come on. Oh, I can only do that 37 more times. <laughs> Listen, for the final level of deep fear, we're only going to give you 300 first aid kits and air grenades, okay? Oh my god, are you playing on professional difficulty? Yeah, I just get a little closer and... <laughs> I feel like new new monsters in these games should be like a little more threatening <laughs> than, you know, just stand still and shoot. Or to maybe look a little intimidating. Yeah, right? It looked like something you'd see with Chuck E. Cheese with an armor. It sounds like you just got the right answer on a game show. <laughs> you killed the Yetis, suck? John. Now you get to go to the next level. <laughs> now for our pop trivia question. Is this game any good? Answer, no. Ding, 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 ding. You're correct. You won ten air grenades. <laughs> the intelligence room is the last room in this game. <laughs> like we're finally here. Slenderman, can you negotiate getting this torch or something? <laughs> Sunderman, how would you work this out? Wait, sorry. Sunderman, what are you doing here? <laughs> Give the guy a torch, his monster's all around. <laughs> That's what Deep Fear is missing, honestly. <laughs> Slenderman? Slenderman. Oh my I god, a monster? Believe it. Here? <laughs> Not anymore. Oh, well. Yeah, it takes care of that. And... <laughs> Do we kill all three with those two shots, I hope? Deep fear, where the shotgun just clears out the whole room. Basically a BFG 9000. It's so nice of them to give you the best weapon in the game so early. Long time no see, John. Uh, Colonel uh, McCoy. Long time never see. You know each other. He was one of my men. One of the best. He called me I Buff Leon Kennedy. Were hiding here. I thought you were done with the ocean after that day. <laughs> well, there's no time to talk about it now. <laughs> yes, Commander. <laughs> Unfortunately, the monsters you were talking about are real. They're humans, but their bodies have been taken over. <laughs> yeah, right. What, oh, what's the matter, Gina? Why do they have bug eyes? Mayor, I got kind of scared. Is she burned? So I came here. <laughs> oh. I just came straight from the tanning bed. Uh, this is Dr. Weisberg, the MI area lead researcher. They look like nice Binding of Isaac characters. <laughs> nice to meet you, You got all the wrong upgrades. Mr. Bob, man! Come to my room quickly! It's terrible! Dubois? <gasps> Dubois. What's, what's happening with Dubois? Oh, there's not enough time left in the video to find out. I know, I left it as a cliffhanger, I'm afraid. The biggest cliffhanger of Deep Fury yet! We did leave off on quite the cliffhanger. And Dubois. I know you're very eager to see what happened to our good friend Dubois. Don't interrupt my exclamation, Dubois, what happened? We don't know, that's how I'm... part three ended. Dubois was in absolute peril. Peril! 
Uh, we've established that you can download air, bullets, and reserve air at various points throughout the game. John is basically an inventory hoarder. It's like you put on a cheat code going into this game. Right, right, right. You cannot die. They should call it Deep Pockets, really. Yeah, he's like carrying around one of those chests in the Resident Evil series where you throw all your shit. But he, he just has that with him at all times. Full of air grenades and quote-unquote kits. Good for him. You know what, honestly? I am fucking sick of these horror games that are actually difficult. You think you need tension in your horror games for them to be good? Hey, Amnesia, can I start with a gallon of lantern oil and, like, a gallon of laudanum and that'd be that? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Really? Dead Space Infinite Ammo. Maybe? Hello? <laughs> yeah, Think about seriously. It. Don't let that Isaac guy go in alone. It's yeah. ridiculous. Don't make him start out with no weapons. Just have him with a full arsenal. Everything unlocked from the get-go. Anyway, it's much scarier. Enough shitting around, though. It's time for some fucking deep fear. Let's right? get into it. Let's get scared. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Yes! That ambient noise! I love it. I feel like my air is running out immediately. <gasps> Dubois, your room looks like a hospital suite. Mm, oh, it's dangerous to fight there. Oh. Why? Oh, if the air system is broken, not only will there be no air, but there will be a pressure buildup and the building will collapse. Damn. And if all that air leaks into the ocean, the air will expand and cause a blowout phenomenon above water. We've got to tell Clancy and make him stop. He got punched in the nuts before he delivered his dialogue, right? I can't contact the SEALs. I have a bad feeling. About Can you this. go and call them back? Okay. I'll contact them to open the docking area for you. It's in your hands now. I read what would happen from a horoscope, actually. So if anything goes wrong, it's now officially your fault, John. <laughs> Even though we dismissed you before as a helpless civilian. They're really inconsistent about that, aren't they? Yeah. Every I time John Mayer talks, I feel like he should be waving to his parents in the audience. Danny, get the gondola ready. The SEALs are heading towards the air unit area. If they fight there, it'll be a disaster. Come with me to the what? launch area. Why do you have a different voice? <laughs> What what happened here? We're tag teaming voice acting this role. <laughs> Kill it! Do it, John. You know you want him. Use all of your ammo. The air is so finicky, room to room. <laughs> you think it's like regulate or something, right? Mm -hmm. They'd have like some kind of system for that, being the fucking navy and all. The more I watch Deep Fear, the more I imagine myself changing channels, and that's what the numbers are changing. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's what else is on. No, that's that's John and. <laughs> that's the true fear, is that any channel on your television is deep fear. Oh my god, that's terrifying. Finally, the uh -oh. soundtrack kicks in in the passageways. It makes me think something's gonna happen in deep fear. I know, like, once the sound kicks in, it kind of works. It's just the game is so shitty that... <laughs> like, look at that. That guy dropped like a <laughs> pancake wood. Do I need gun? No, I don't need gun. I will put gun back, because I do not need gun. Let me keep reflecting on what a tragic end that was. Do you need CPR? And he stuffs an air grenade down his throat. <laughs> Jump on this air grenade, you'll feel better in a moment. It works for me. Oh, there's another one. Oh, we can't even recognize his face. But we'll just steal his stun grenade. A stun grenade? <laughs> and another one. <laughs> and another one. Oh my god. I love the fucking game. Wow, these guys were paranoid. I watched a little ahead. Diabetes, are you ready for the first boss? Oh, of deep fear? This has bosses. <laughs> Apparently it does. Okay. So you're not just making up shit about a boss? There is actually a boss? There is actually a boss, yeah. We just fought the first one and our second one's coming in this Is round. the boss numerology? <laughs> I, think so. I think it might be. Okay. Look at that top-down camera angle. You know shit's going down. Oh, even the long player senses there's a boss. I better get everything. <laughs> now it's time for the second boss. <laughs> 28 air. The second boss. Ammo. How much can you fill your pockets? <laughs> oh my god. And the third boss, it just goes to credits. <laughs> you Let's beat the game. So. Exactly. My god. We survived another R-charge boss. Whoa. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Mayor. And he mastered that exit menu puzzle. Uh-oh. Now it's time for a boss, the fourth boss. We didn't want to surprise you with the boss fight, so here, have some music. <laughs> it's a rat. <laughs> no, no, John, right, right behind you there. 
uh, my pivoting skills not adequate. Is that a download thing in the wall back there? Probably, yes. I like to think those one and two tanks in the back are just extra lives as well. Is this seriously a boss fight? Yes, it is. It's, um, it's Radigan. The ultimate boss. I, okay. It, it gets, it's, it's a lot scarier if you haven't collected the thousand items the game has given you. That's the idea. Have you ever almost drowned, but then were thankful you had a resuscitation kit with you? You know how Scrooge McDuck's money bin is filled with coins? That's how John Mayer is with first aid items. Dives in a vault full of air grenades and kits. Just swims through them, basically. <laughs> Keeps them all to himself. Oh, boss. Wait. Uh... Um, you want me to tell you what that is? A bomb of some sort? It is a bomb. Okay. It is a bomb. That, that boss, I guess, was hiding. Now you have to fight the bomb! Quick, cover those sprites with the other sprites. <laughs> only only one drawing of an explosion is necessary. You're wearing your We're 3D glasses right. for this, right? Oh my god, yeah. Okay. Um. <laughs> Deep fear, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> That's awesome. Soundtrack says something really bad is gonna happen. I. I'm really not seeing the danger, I'm, though. Yeah. All right, well, I guess the pressure of the ocean is compressing the ship. We designed the, the hell out of this thing, and you're going to see every inch. Oh, my God, the, the Harrier's turning into a monster. <laughs> it's a monster Harrier, the game's second boss. There's a bomb attached to it that'll... Huh? We gave you some training reels. We feel like you're ready to move up from rat to Harrier. Oh, my God, we're going to disc two. Oh, we crammed enough excitement on disc one. <laughs> I'm imagining the long player. Close the CD shaking. door to restart the game if you're not too afraid. Look at this view. <laughs> 200 meters deep in the ocean, where the light can't reach. I spent most of my life in a submarine. But the government looks at one mistake and cuts me off from my dreams by locking me up in this ocean floor prison. <laughs> one mistake? Oh, one of the submarine missiles I launched hit a passenger ship. <laughs> it sunk. I was in disputed waters what? right before a war. <laughs> Those little oh, mistakes. Bad luck seemed to follow me around. <laughs> the energy unit area is about to melt down. There's not much time left. <laughs> the only way to survive is to escape using the SEAL's DSRV. Could you call all base survivors here? But I don't know where everyone is. I know that Dubois John, is headed towards the energy in that area. <laughs> We've got to try to save everyone. <coughs> I understand. <laughs> I'll get the DSRV ready. Wait a fucking minute! <laughs> <laughs> they locked me down here after I killed civilians with a submarine missile and torch touched off a nuclear war that destroyed the continent. Those bureaucratic assholes. Talk about a slap on the wrist, right? <laughs> <laughs> you ever hear of <laughs> Judge Nihilus? You be judge yourself. <laughs> oh my god, that was awesome. <laughs> that was totally unjustified. <laughs> Look at this view of a wall. <laughs> anyway, going on to a horrible thing I did. <laughs> <laughs> this, this is what I get after killing a church full of nuns for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, hey, April O'Neil, what's going on? So I drove a school bus over a canyon, and they... I'm glad you're okay, John. Before. Did you hear what Commander Clancy did? <laughs> I accidentally launched a missile and killed the Pope. And also thousands of children who were visiting him. And then they got on my case about it. Just for that, I got remanded to the seat table. <laughs> Sometimes life just ain't fair. I lost my wife in a yachting accident, you. Yeah, I killed thousands of people. <laughs> I launched a missile to cruise I mean, ship. a guy just commits a little accidental genocide, and then people... <laughs> it's, like, it's like the military somehow frowns on that. It's like there's liability. I mean, come on. Oh yeah, monsters are in this game besides Clancy. <laughs> 
<laughs> See, that's the thing. Who should you be most afraid of? It's deep. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> it's a classic theme. Who are the real monsters in this game? <laughs> it's obviously Clancy. <laughs> it's pretty obvious. I mean, that monster didn't even hurt anyone before you put him down, but Glancy killed untold numbers of people. You launch one missile at a passenger ship, and they call you a monster. This place is about to melt down. I don't trust Glancy. Did you know Why? he sank a passenger ship on purpose? Yeah, yes, we did. He his rank. He said it was an accident. <laughs> that was no accident. The sonar person warned him that a civilian ship was approaching. You seem to know a lot. Of course, I was the sonar person. <laughs> That's why I can't trust him. People trying to get to Washington tried to cover it up, but it was found out in an internal check and taken to court martial. That's why he was sent here. He's the type who will kill a man for his career. <laughs> I'm sorry, what is this? Anyway, jail? Get ready to escape. You sure you want to launch that missile? It's a passenger ship. I'm sorry, you sound like you're being sarcastic, so I don't believe you. <laughs> anyway, infinite ammo. <laughs> this game is awesome. <laughs> it has everything you need. It's no. it's funny, you get all the shit you want. <laughs> I, was, I was so worried about it being boring, but it really wasn't. It's game is not lacking in anything. <laughs> Don't laugh at the <coughs> elevator. So sorry, sorry. The final boss is you having to listen to Clancy's horrible <laughs> stories about what he's done to people. I, I didn't tell you. I, I was undercover and I gave Osama Bin Laden the idea for 9-11. Can't believe he went through with it. It was ridiculous. <laughs> oh, Clancy. He's that calls for some minor punishment. <laughs> now you're reprimanded to the C table for two years. You're getting probated for six hours, Clancy. <laughs> Sharon, where's the elevator that's connected to the energy unit area? To get to the elevator, you need the passcode to get into the room before it. Do you know the pass number? Yeah, it's 2751. Why do you ask? Something needs to be done about the energy unit. It's about to melt down. You escape in the DSRV. Then we have to set this child free. Will it take long? Mm -hmm. Yes, because the power's out. The sequence is complicated and I have to go to the control room. Hurry! Okay. Oh, I've seen the DN area diver go around the outside of the big table to get to the energy unit in a robotic suit. DN area diver. Okay, thanks. John, be careful. <laughs> Cut! That's beautiful take. We don't need to do that again. Excellent job, Sharon. Alright, that was a good cold read, so now memorize those lines and deliver them next time. I'm hoping in the next three minutes... Oh, the large animals room. Here we go. Well, there's no there's no great music, so I don't think a boss is coming. The large animals room. Oh, Clancy killed everything in here. Hmm. <laughs> oh my god, they turned into a golf course. You monsters! <laughs> this is Clancy! the worst thing you've ever done, Clancy! Alright, um, What? Uh, <laughs> um, let's just move on, John. This is, this, this makes, it, this makes too little it, sense even. Is this not a good time to ask the question of why? Clancy! Clancy! I mean, he just so casually dropped that information to us. Oh no, there's no elevator here. Oh, by the way, mild backstory about myself. <laughs> John, this elevator is closed. I you mean, maybe it. you've heard this, but let me just get it out there. <laughs> Not a you big deal. Have, you might have seen some terrible video called Adults Reacted to Clancy. <laughs> that maybe impugned my character a little, but... Oh, by the way, I launched a torpedo back in time and it, it caused the extinction of the dinosaurs. <laughs> I my inadvertently bad. caused the Holocaust. My bad. <laughs> I have a favor to ask, John. Can you get me a better if you voice actor? see Anna, could you tell her that she doesn't need to act so macho? She's, uh, macho. cute if she's quiet. Tell her yourself. If I could, I wouldn't be asking you. Oh, no. Oh. Danny, okay. did you not get a cold? I'll tell her. Wait, we're not uh, gonna get an explanation for that? That's the... Did we... 
did you cut some? Hello? Uh, all right. I, I think we left something unresolved. Maybe, uh, wait, you... I, I, I don't think our conversation was done. I like to think John Mayer got bored and just left mid-conversation. <laughs> so we haven't quite gotten through all the intrigue, but we do know that there's a, a virus that's turning people into monsters. That's right. It's by, and it works by popping off their fingernails. Did so you... Sh- That'll get funnier five more times. Anyway, um... It just gives you a chance to think. Shouldn't you go tell Danny what Anna said and see if she wants to invite him to the uh, Sadie Hawkins dance? Oh That's what God. this is about, right? I think so. Okay. And now she's just repeating what we already knew. Slowly. All right. We can fix the leak. But we need some secret weapon. Like a neat... What? Gum gun? We have to go talk to Danny now! <laughs> Wasn't that like four elevators away? Look, I know this is our Halloween-themed game, but we're well past Halloween right now. We need election-themed games. God almighty. Like, is, is there a vote to replace um, Clancy with somebody else? Or at least recall Clancy for what he did? Because I think that's justified. <laughs> what, what the fuck is the gum gun? Just... But... Just... I, I, I just ask that you respect the elevator. Because it's the only consistent which, thing we which have one? in deep fear right now. We gotta do the whole... We have to do the elevator again on the way back. Yes, we do, but at the I'm same so time, you have to respect it. Elevator. It is the only constant in the deep fear universe. It's in the Navy area. Some He's Korean guy made a song about it crazy again. It's in the Navy area? Well, yeah. Well, okay. The lift is ready. Go ahead and I'll follow. Okay. I feel like whenever any character talks, they're trying to land an airplane. <laughs> it's, it's, it's like a semaphore thing. It's how people in the Navy talk, basically. It's like sign language. You're not sure who's yeah, deaf. They're or simultaneously not. communicating for the deaf as they talk. <laughs> Surprisingly, well, sign language only has three or four gestures. <laughs> Fun fact. Uh, I already have the data. Okay. Well, <laughs> glad glad to make sure I have the data Ooh, anyway. Now that we know we have the data, we can go tell Danny. <laughs> if, if you're going back to that elevator, I would be so fucking disappointed in you. <laughs> Don't do it. Don't you fucking do it, John Mayer. Go into the elevator, John. John, you wasted air doing go. that. I'm just saying. Let Don't, us no, think. Go. go. Ride it. Nope. That's right. Go, so, go ride the, the elevator. Room. Go to the other room. You need to... all. Oh. Anna's room? For God's sakes, Sean! Elevator. You see, like, you think it would be a game mechanic, though, in the rooms with low air, that there'd be monsters, but there aren't always. Mm hmm. It's kind of like it's just a really stupid mechanic. Well, the monsters don't understand their numbers very well. They come into a room seeing 17 air, do they know what that means? I'm just saying, though, if I were, to, if I were making this game, like, why would I need to add that part of it? Like, running out of air is already enough tension. I mean, is it really it, tension when he has 60 air grenades on him right now? I mean, I was about to say, yeah, once... once. I mean, he could air. just fart and then the room would be filled with 99 air. Oh, no. Ant... Who, who the fuck is Anthony? <laughs> <laughs> what? Whoa, who, Deep Fear, stop throwing these plot twists at us. What, is this the room? Who the fuck is Anthony? Look, you've had a hard time. Take a first aid kit. Are we really traversing the whole fucking game map for this stupid gun gum? <laughs> Wait, wait, gum gun? What do we need the gum gun for? I don't, isn't that what Jar Jar Binks is? <laughs> I think so. I assume it's a weapon that keeps us minty fresh. Oh, you know what it is? It's that Ronpa game that I like so much. Oh yeah, it's gum gun. Forums. Gum gun Ronpa, Gun right. gun Ronpa, right. Jesus Christ. Get on the lift when I give the signal from the control room. Here, I'll give you this. Why is he out of breath? Where did you come from? It's <laughs> the Navy area ID car key. You'll need this for the Navy area. ERS trained. <laughs> I owe you one. <laughs> okay, anytime. It was like a baby clap. <laughs> Here it comes, John. Can you get it? <laughs> I was hoping it would get, catch John in the head like a Chinese star. <laughs> 
or it hits him on the side, and it turns out that Danny missed. <laughs> oh, that was so much better than I could have hoped for. Wow. What if it turned out the elevators were behind the whole thing? <laughs> but they still wouldn't be as bad as Clancy. That's true. <laughs> the elevators killed five staircases. I can't get that image of him catching it out of my head. He's <laughs> <laughs> clapping like a baby. <laughs> John Mayer does have a bit of baby face going for him. He does. Oh. <laughs> this is what Big Bird mutated into. Good. All right. Thank you. That's what happens when you cut PBS funding. Well, tension's over now. Yep. It, yep. Better shoot that nothing. What do you mean the tension's over? It was there? <laughs> can can I mean, you point me to where the tension was? <laughs> the tension meter in the upper left went from zero to one briefly. Oh, I forgot that was Out a of a hundred. Yes. <laughs> Blinked on screen. You really gotta watch for it. I better see this gum gun in use. I'm just... What is it supposed to do? <laughs> I wish so... I wish to God someone had thrown him the gun gun. Gun gun. I was hoping the f that maybe the final weapon of this game will be the gun gun. What is it supposed to do besides assist baseball players? I think the gun gun is a gun that shoots other guns. Oh, okay. Which, which themselves shoot. But the gum gun, I'm not really sure. Oh, oh, someone uh, sent us another fun fact. This actually was fairly successful. Uh, how? And in fact, of the, all the games we have wrong parade is the most successful. We've wrong parade some shitty games. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we have. How? I can't believe More successful than Time Gal. Or Ninja Hayate, are you sure? I'm somehow Are sure. you saying Dark Seed 2 sold better or did not sell as well as Deep Fear? I gotta think King's Quest 6 did better than The Deep Ubiquitous Fear. Cobra pales in comparison to Deep Fear. <laughs> I know, Cobra. Cobra? <laughs> the game everyone knew. <laughs> the Jurassic Park game, which has Jurassic Park in the title of it. <laughs> Did not well, outsell Deep Fear. Good. Here's 90 of them. <laughs> Alright. Well, <laughs> another puzzle solved by John Mayer. It only took a fucking hour. <laughs> well, you're right. <laughs> Shit gets crazy in the latter part of the game. God damn. This is what happened this whole video. We gave a tank to Danny and got one more item. Basically. If by shit you if uh, by shit goes crazy you mean Aaron's galore, then you're in deep fear. I actually just checked Audacity just to be like, I'm definitely recording this right because I'm never fucking watching this again. Oh yeah, because we gotta keep this gold. Hey, I'm sorry, viewers. Whatever this video comes out as we're posting it, I can't take it. I can't watch deep The viewers anymore. have got to hear our complete silence during the myriad elevator scenes. Oh, they've X'd out of this. I mean, come on. The people need to hear us say, gum gun. Turn on the lights. Well, why'd you turn off the lights, Anna? Anna, you're kind of squishy sounding. I don't know if that's a good yeah. idea. Oh, just Sounds like you sipped in jello. John, how long did it take you to push a button? <laughs> I feel kind of funny for some reason. And that's when John fell in love. Oh my god, is that a boob? We better censor this. And it looks like you uh, used its one-arm push-ups too much. <laughs> you have to even out the body. Yeah, Anna. I mean, use the other arm. If only I could leave somehow. No. Shoot the fucking gun, you idiot! Oh, well, alright. <laughs> Sorry about that, Rambo. You're dead, I guess. <laughs> anyway. Here, have, have another one of these, you... <laughs> this is ridiculous. <laughs> so the challenge is, do you remember all the inventory you have? <laughs> Time to use it, John. Well, good luck, Rambo. At least you have your body to feed off of. <laughs> <laughs> I am the worst at rescue. Well, anyway... By the way, if you ever need to think about stuff, someone uploaded a 10-hour elevator sequence on YouTube from this game. You're shitting me, really? Yeah, true story. It's amazing. Wow. Either Good 10 job. hours or 10 minutes, but either way, a long period of time to reflect on Deep Fear. Welcome to the least play-tested part of Deep Fear. <laughs> Do 
we need any sort of animation for sprinting in the gym? Nah. Bend him forward and he'll practically go. Let's move along to the next area. <laughs> Playing as Eeyore. Why do you think you need a passcode on this, like, underwater section? Like, who are you trying to lock out? Don't worry, fish. You're not bothering me. Explosives. Where can we get those? Explosives Your inventory is in the separate connection <laughs> park. There should be C4 explosives. How do you get in? You need the passcode. <sighs> it is 3742. There's no time. Hurry and get it. I'll be right back. After All these right. messages. <laughs> and we're back. By the way, these grenades can't help, could they? <laughs> All 100 of them? Like, define oh, explosive for me, Dubois, because I have a bunch of shit falls out of his pocket. I have 100 grenades. Oh, I mean 94. I had a boss fight earlier. <laughs> so I'd better not use these. <laughs> Who are you? John Mayer, ERS. Hi. <laughs> That's I get away from hilarious. Me. It's me, McCoy. Colonel McCoy? Stay where you are! Who's that? Listen from there. I uh, headed up the SEAL team. Clancy sent him out. The time. Him back. Oh, I have left. He's short. No. Yes. My body is being taken over by a creature. Ah, it's irritating. <laughs> <laughs> a much more somber catching cold. something scene. Can I use the C4 on the fish? <laughs> Why won't you fish leave me alone? Mm -hmm. Oh wait, mm -hmm. Got another really sad cutscene. This is like the sad part of Elite Beat Agents is what's happening basically. Oh, is this where you acknowledge that the other guy died? I think so. <laughs> He's even slower in the cutscene! I think the cameraman's wearing a big gem suit as well. <laughs> I'm taking you with me! Damn monster! Why the long neck? I'll just inject the box? That? Hmm. Alright. That was the best we could do for an explosion. <laughs> <laughs> It's a living. <laughs> I think he hurt my suit. <laughs> oh, water's coming into my mouth now. <laughs> Dubois, I hope this doesn't screw up our plans. <laughs> um. So. Wait, now you care about it? <laughs> I just realized who he was. Oh, yes, that's right. Put the C4 on the cooling tank panel. Tear apart the panel and expose the wiring. That way, an electric current can run from here. I was in the same room, though. Genius. <laughs> uh -oh. There's no time. Go and place the C4 on the coolant tank. Did you not wave your hand right in front of my okay. face after you coughed on it? It's rude. I have a... Damn it. We're, we're losing characters left and right. <laughs> Do we know what causes the monster transformation to happen? No. Like, it's not zombie style where they just get bitten or clawed at, right? I guess it's just airborne. Yeah, you airborne a, sort of thing. If you have a cold, you're good. Unless you have a cold, yeah. Alright, we got ourselves a swimming pool. And now we're gonna die. Oh. Hurry! Oh, I was kidding. We have to escape! How? The big gym is damaged! There's a tunnel it's that wet. leads to the big table. Okay, let's go. <laughs> I can't go in this condition. Don't my give leg. up. <laughs> Surprise. I made up my mind, John. Get out of here. I don't want to hurt you. John, I will open you. the tunnel no. door for you with the remote. But, but hurry and go. I don't want you to see my hand, Acne. None of these, none of these, like, I don't know, people are very good at sacrificing themselves, it seems <laughs> like. <laughs> Like, I'm just gonna wait till the transformation's mostly finished. So do you think Anna and Debar are gonna hook up in the end now, maybe? I don't know. I had sent some uh, Annie Dana... Uh, Anna Danny, excuse me, tension yeah. before. So I'm gonna check uh, fanfiction.net. Please do. Mm -hmm. For some Annie... Like, God damn it, Anna Danny Dubois. It's like a tongue twister. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Who is it? The music Man. makes me think it's somebody important. <laughs> <laughs> God 
Come on. <laughs> what the? Do we have to treat Tubal like a dickhead? We haven't exterminated enough of his dignity. So, right. Was the notion that that was just this passageway filling with water? I, I'm guessing so. And none of the rushing water or all those boxes hurt. Yeah. Uh -oh. oh, come on. Oh, come on. Look at his fucking arms. This is ridiculous. Did Dubois just test really positively among focus groups? I guess he must have. So Dubois is now the nemesis of Deep Fear. <laughs> yes, yes, he actually is. <laughs> I'd prefer the Mr. X, but... <laughs> ERS! Hey, John. We have to hurry and set the dolphins free. Wait, Sharon! Eh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you just stand there? Is it Dubois again? It is. I know what it is, actually. Okay. And, uh, it is not Dubois. Sharon! It's... Be careful. Remember the cow? <laughs> Are you kidding me? The dog. I am not. The cow. Please save him. Come on, Sharon! Uh, Let's go back John, to did you together. see that? When you get back... What? Would you have an ice cream with me? What? Of course. An ice cream? I don't really know how old Sharon is supposed to be. It's I'm kinda not weird. clear on that. Oh yeah, there was a guttural growl. Or and a monster. I should probably address that. I bet you it's loading up that same boss music again. Or not. Wow, that is a wow. fucked cow. This is like the... F oh, it's, <laughs> it, it looks like it's stuck in a wall. Boo, motherfucker! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the horrible <laughs> bosses of Deep Fear. The cow is trying to do a Kool-Aid Man impression, but it's not going well. <laughs> oh my god, this is <laughs> awful. Wow. I just want back in my pen! <laughs> my head stuck, help me. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'm not all Already that bad. picking the best, best angle to murder now? Come on, <laughs> let's do it. <laughs> Point blank with a shotgun. Oh man. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, were we actually not damaging it before? Uh, oh, like, apparently not. Yeah, I guess you can only hit it in the head or... Oh, then it deflects. <laughs> <laughs> that was our... <laughs> The virus even affects balloon animals. Oh, no. This is worse than we thought. Wait, isn't that like a Dubois type of enemy? No, it doesn't have the shoulder tentacles. What was all that green crap on the bottom when the game started shaking? You, I have you are that, that stingy with your air grenades. <laughs> that is the only thing that they do. <laughs> no, we, we really gotta save these. You refuse to use them for their express purpose. Please be a monster. <laughs> that would be great. Go! Or Sharon's life will be wasted! It already has been. <laughs> All right. Yeah, you're boring. <laughs> Good job, Echo. <laughs> the smartest character, and the, then he's eaten by the fish. Go, star in your own game. Sharon, this is what you wanted. Well, I think she would have wanted to have lived as well. Yeah, I think that <laughs> might have been at the top of her list. She, she wanted probably quite a few things. Like, live a happy life, then free the dolphins. Yeah, basically. There might be even some other stuff in between all that. <laughs> like stalk John Mayer. Right, exactly. <laughs> then he, like, he starts making out with her body, like, this is what you wanted. <laughs> <laughs> and then, who are the real monsters flashes across the screen. <laughs> now here's my... <laughs> You know what I just realized? We have had our actual first successful rescue of the, as emergency <laughs> rescue squad. Well, John's yeah. gonna brag about all this to his ERS buds. I hope the monkey's a boss later. I hope John Mayer said I couldn't save everyone to purposefully keep it ambiguous. Yeah. You know, like, I couldn't save... Just um, uh, hoping she didn't ask a follow-up question like, what percent of people did you rescue? Yeah, well, did, well who did you rescue? Uh, well... The dolphin? Dolphin guy... <laughs> Dolphin, nope. How about the cow? Did you save the cow? No, no, you know. The elevator still works. This is a cutscene heavy episode. Yeah, right? Commander Clancy! C 
Fancy left us. And <laughs> <laughs> he shot her, maybe? Gina, wake up. Clancy. Um, Fucking Clancy, okay. man. I just fainted. What happened? As soon as I entered the room, Commander Clancy. No. <laughs> Was it that much of a surprise, John? My life means more than all of you small fish. I can't end my days here. I need to get the back at the people in Washington who treated me like a criminal. The survivors. Treated you like I can't let them live. Uh. <laughs> you, you didn't notice that? <laughs> <laughs> you were such a jerk. <laughs> Fucking asshole. <laughs> I heard about what you did. <laughs> I mean, this is the least you deserve, honestly. Oh, no. Uh, that mildly irritates me. It's like a big boss fight now. It's in the music. Anna, Anna, John wanted to tell you something. Is that her or the monkey? <laughs> Both. Dead it boy! What's up? Terrible at rescue. Oh, Rambo. Oh. Yeah, she's in there. <laughs> I'll just live out my remaining hours with you, dog. God, you're a fat dog. I don't know, did we already lose track of, um... Of well, this Gina? is probably Gina. <laughs> Just my luck. Oh well. Aren't we just gonna be bringing the monsters to wherever we're going? That's what makes it work. Okay. The driving a heavy thing theme. Wow, I, I was right, it is even slower. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no! Uh. You know it's the end game when they're getting rid of all the elevators. We hate the environments we designed. Trash them! Uh, and yes, that is the best we can do with glass. Yeah. <laughs> it's confetti! Yay! Yay! Fuck you, cow! <laughs> if you're not dead, you're... <laughs> Dramatic John Mayer look. Can he, can he not see any of that, though? <laughs> he, he can hear the soundtrack, so he understands. I forgot, what does this thing we're on do? It moves from one place to another. Like a mode of transportation. But why again? Or to where, maybe, is the better question. To a uh, less monstrously infested part of the water. Why didn't we do that a lot earlier? Or get other people there? Uh, Clancy. You, know, you joke, but that probably really was the answer. <laughs> probably. Oh, wait, um, that's not good. <laughs> Oops. Anthony, can you, you do something? Through. Rambo? You shouldn't have flipped all those switches at once. <laughs> that was a childish thing to do. That was the, really the best way to get that impact. Oh, shit, that's like, it's like the inverted castle now. <laughs> Are you ready for deep? Your second quest for the voice acting is great. <laughs> New game plus begins. Hopefully there are no monsters. I kind of mean that. I'm In a bored. passageway? No. <laughs> Wait, isn't this third floor then technically... <sighs> How many monster types have we encountered in this game? Like three, four? <laughs> They're all pretty much the same. <laughs> yeah. Like the green thing is really the same as the white yeti thing, only with two arms. Yeah. There were those tyrant monsters. Yeah, those are like the main ones. Then there are the go go boot monsters, the little velociraptor kind of things, the lion. Is that it? Six? That sounds pretty comprehensive. Oh, there was Th also the thing Clancy. The ceiling things. Clancy, Clancy counts for like 10. Yeah, he, but he's like at least 11 monster types. I really thought for sure we would have fought Clancy, honestly. Yeah. 
but um, or at least debate Clancy. <laughs> Right. And to keep in with the April Fool's theme, once you get to the end of this game and the credits roll, you hear simulation over. Well, look, a new monster. It's what the hell is that? It's certainly not. Is it a not... slime? A blob? <laughs> John Mayer doesn't even want anything to do <laughs> I with that. I don't even want to know. <laughs> I'm gonna go to the library and look this thing up. <laughs> all right. Fortunately, this is the last room, so I think we're gonna have our radio all set. All right. But then, what? There's still 40 minutes of content left in this game somehow. Is there really? Oh my god. Unless there's 40 minutes worth of credits of people who worked on this game. Well, there's a big three, so we know that the third part's in it. Holy! What the? Did they just, like, leave all their fucking enemies to, for this? This is where we'll put all of our B-side monsters. Oh. Uh, could you it... move a little... Uh, I didn't know if I was supposed to be a Metroid or a bug or what. So what were you before you transformed? <laughs> Uh, sorry, excuse me, I can't see where I'm going. <laughs> excuse me, where do I aim? John, you need to tune into the right frequency on the radio. There are six pieces of paper hidden throughout the ship. Let me just get this straight. Going to space uh, can give you an alien virus, is the idea. Apparently. Even though you're in, like, an airtight ship, or, like, you know what I mean? This is a reimagining of the AIDS origin story. Oh, <laughs> this is really social commentary. <laughs> yes. Okay, just making sure. We don't have much time. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Send a rescue team to rescue the rescue team. <laughs> John Mayer should have been like, I have a monkey. <laughs> That's what he, I think he was saying. He's, we have two survivors and one, uh, and then he just forgot it. He's like, yeah. forget the monkey. What about the dog? Yeah, what happened to Rambo? He's around somewhere. Oh god, we're gonna use all our first aid kits because now here's some more infinite first aid kits. <laughs> <laughs> See, I told you. Yep. <laughs> Seriously, infinite. John, you don't have to pick up one at a time. <laughs> you can scoop them up. John, no, John. Oh, oh god, John. John, John, John. <laughs> there. <laughs> John, you don't have to stand up to put things in your pockets. Why are we. Why are we leaving? Well... <laughs> uh, John, what if they try to call you back? <laughs> Hello? Oh, I guess they're dead. Didn't, they, didn't they say to wait? Oh. Hang in there. He's like, I better find that monkey. Hang in there, they fax you one of those cat posters. <laughs> Unfortunately, we have a very important fax, but you need the three fax parts. <laughs> <laughs> then you go collect it, then you get the cat poster. <laughs> <laughs> you put them all together, you get the poster, then the credits roll. John was, in fact, able to hang in there. And also, here's a demotivational poster I found kind of funny. It's just a picture of Clancy. <laughs> Tell me everything. Uh, just summarize it. Well, not everything. Just kind of... 40 years ago, the as an experiment... <laughs> Anthony was shot up into space and returned to Earth. Here's he that file you read. It was a NAS project. It was almost like hibernation. Why were there Commander Clancy hands? was the leader of the pod recovery plan. The Kill them all. Plan. <laughs> he saw Anthony's condition and thought of something. Kill everyone. Spread the parasite cell. It's just instinct for him to save his kind. He didn't mean harm. If you don't mean harm, does that mean you can do anything you want? Oh my god, you're gonna kill a monkey? Whoa. Stop! I understand how you feel, but he can't be allowed to live or taken back to land. Stop, John, please. Uh, she has a point. We're all. Hmm. We're all. Well. No. <laughs> no. This is totally unprecedented. <laughs> This is what I get for trying to kill an innocent monkey. That was an awfully fast transformation. Turns into a heart and says happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> Gina, are you turning into candy? <laughs> Monkey's laughing. <laughs> this is great. Oh no. <laughs> my, an my anime girlfriend told me what would happen next. Uh, John wants to see how this plays out. <laughs> the power of the assault rifle. 
<laughs> I think the game slowdown is fucking it up. Oh, wait, what happened? That's it? Yep, that's that. Oh no, form one is defeated. <laughs> Just pull the pins off every one of your grenades now. Yeah, that stun grenade seems to be doing awesome, John. Good call. Uh, uh, <laughs> okay, So well. the boss is in its patrol pattern. <laughs> <laughs> John, you trying to air hump the ground? What are you doing? Uh, she's over there, John. John, come on. Uh, Peekaboo! Had, had we not tried to kill the monkey, this wouldn't have happened, I'm assuming. I guess not. What's with the green flashes? What's with the wings? She doesn't even fly. What's with everything about deep fear? Did this, uh, the people who designed the creatures, they did not understand horror even a little bit, right? I don't think so. They understand it goo, I think. <laughs> and the AI programmers didn't understand a whole lot either, did they? <laughs> and Anthony Chip won, you're a jerk. <laughs> this is all your fault. At Gina Ape Lover, do you have a weakness? <laughs> At Clancy is cool. Clancy, <laughs> hey, you're dead. <laughs> Clancy Hitler Nazi sign. Oh, I think that was the last hit. This switch is in the engine room. Push it and then get in the pod. The force of explosion should carry you to the surface. Finish this invasion. It's up to you. That's not a really bad idea. I'm gonna go trick or treating now. <laughs> Okay, but I'm killing your monkey if I see him, let's just be clear. Well, I'm sure you've learned your lesson after I pummeled 30, 300 bullets into you. I wasn't able to get over not rescuing Stella because I didn't manage to rescue anyone, so... <laughs> my character arc is unchanged. Well, I've got a monkey and a dog to save. <laughs> I got that dolphin, that was something. Yeah. Maybe. I'm gonna write my memoir about that dolphin. We'll just insert our self-destruct key, because it's the stupidest idea we could have come up with. Maybe you insert the self-destruct key and the whole thing explodes instantly. <laughs> April Fools! <laughs> April Fools, you played Deep Fear. Um, were you supposed Dude, to say something there? Is there a sound that was going to come out of your mouth? Or out of your mouth? <laughs> is the game on mute? Wait, what? I've got to stop Anthony from growling at John Mayer. <laughs> oh, is she gonna? Was he gonna bite him? Was the idea? But doesn't John have the cold anyway? So. Um, what about Rambo? <laughs> was that bye? Is that what he waved? Yeah. What happened to the dog? I, I think the voice actors just left by this point in the. <laughs> You, you can't kill my monkey, only I can. <laughs> let's just let's just calm down, Anthony, and wait for our deaths. And then as the thing goes, like the pod goes away, John's like, "Oh shit, the dog." Yeah, uh, I forgot something. I, I am terrible at rescue. Well, I'll say hi to that dolphin at least on the way out. And like and like we said before, that was really mostly Sharon's doing. Yeah. In fact, if she had just been a little stronger, I could push the one lever. Hey, we don't even need John Mayer. The pod hits the dolphin on the way out and kills it. Through no credit to myself, I rescued the dog. Well. <laughs> and it. it quietly peters out into nothingness. <laughs> oh, there's the dolphin, too. Oh, my lord. Or maybe that's one of the enemy fish and it's just going to attack the pod. <laughs> Credits are going. They really were embarrassed. This is a list of people who asked not to be included. John Mayer, how did you do? I rescued everyone. <laughs> oh, April. Fools. Everyone who was on the ship. There's a dolphin down there and this dog. <laughs> I was the only person on board. <laughs> Duh, huh. mm. That's it. That's really what you <laughs> well, end on. <laughs> we needed to include that. <laughs> I mean, it was pretty funny. Yeah. Well, deep fear. He had a look on his face like they were about to throw something at him. Jesus Christ. That could not have ended any... So fuck you. <laughs> I learned about depth, but as in this game had none. I'm with you. Alright. Dead to rights? Dead to rights. Air. Grenades.